out of me I never let you see I keep a cage but I can't control it I feel it deep within It's just beneath the skin I must confess that I feel like a monster I hate what I've become The fact is just begun Hey what's up bitches and we got another Pokemon Wi-Fi battle here and this one is against Oh my god noob from YouTube and um yeah um he asked me for a battle um and I was like you know what I'll battle you right now because I have nothing else to do and I thought like I might as well try out this new Pokemon Mawile and it's intense but you'll find out in this battle so um I lead off with my Uxie and he leads off with a Moltres and I'm already like god damn it fuck my life now I gotta deal with a fucking skirt Moltres son of a bitch so I go into my Arcanine to take the fire move but she, he actually goes for a U-turn and he switches out into his Feraligator so uh, I knew he would predict a switch here so I knew he'd go for Dragon Dance so I had to stay in and go for the will o -Wisp and hope it didn't miss and luckily it hit so that's awesome so now this for alligator is like no threat to me at all of course so I go into my um, Uxie and uh, just to wall this thing out and just to set up my rock so that that Moltres will not be a threat to me either because I really hate Moltres in UU they're like one of the most annoying Pokemons that I have ever dealt with because they're just annoying um so he goes for the waterfall and um, he gets a crit I was like oh you son of a bitch I'm gonna kill you so I go for a psychic and it does like a quarter which is okay I guess I mean it's just an oxie what do you expect so um I switch out here and I go into my uh, pie chunk um pie chunk is a uh, youtuber who does like awesome narrations and stuff so yeah uh, if you and I might as well give a shout out to her since all that stuff. So um, if you don't know who Pychunk is, there will be a link in the description on your right. She is an awesome narrator and she's got really good Wi-Fi battles. So I do recommend you go subscribe to her now. Because if you don't, again, I will kill you and stuff. And I'm the king of all bitches and stuff, which is kind of funny. So um... My Mawile is actually a sub puncher, which I was trying to use, but I totally forgot that for alligators can carry Earthquake, which like ah, uh, which completely fucked me up, of course. So um, I go into my Uxie because he died, cause you know it was a double KO, of course. So I go into Uxie and then I see the shit on top. I'm like, um, I think it's safe to go into Arcanine just to get the status off the something, so. Um, he switches out, and I thought that he would go into his, uh, Moltres here, so I went for the Toxic instead, but he goes into his Alakazam, and I was like, oh, fuck, the Synchronized Toxic. Oh my god, god damn it. So, um, he goes for a Psychic, and that does quite a lot. I was like, wow, okay, that's awesome. Um, I just go for a Flamethrower, and I get a crit. I was like, oh lo, lo, lo that's a fail right there, I guess. And stuff, so yeah. Um, out comes the shit on top. And he's just gonna go for the fake out for the revenge kill, which is cool. And stuff, so yeah. Um, now I bring in blindness, cause I know I can take any attacks from this uh shit on top. So um yeah. Uh I go for a thunder wave in case he wanted to switch his here, so I, te I got the Paralyze on the ship on top, which is cool, I guess. So uh, here I go for a Psychic, and it barely lives. I was like, what the fuck? I can't even see the health bar. But he, then he gets stopped by Parahax, which was gay. Because I'm betting that thing was going to go for the Stone Age right there. So, um, yeah, so then he went for the Bullet Punch just to get some damage off, and then he dies by Life Orb. So out comes this Moltres, and thank God I lived this air... Thank God I lived this air slash, and thank God I didn't get a flinch, cause otherwise I would've just banged my head on the wall. Like this. 
And thank God that did happen! So, yay, I'm so fucking lucky. So, now I know I can set up on this thing with my Registeel because I know it's Scarf. So, I get off a curse. And here, I know he's gonna switch out here, so I decided to set up another curse, which is what I do. So, um, yeah, he doesn't intimidate me because I have clear body! Ha ha! Take that, bitch! So, I get out my second curse, and, um, I'm pretty safe to take any attacks this Arcanine throws at me, except if the fucker was a bandit. So I was like, what the fuck, that did way too much! It, the fucker has to be banded, because I have two curses open and he can't do that much, so... Yeah, and he do it chaos my rage is still like, oh, you son of a bitch, so, um... Yeah, um, I just hope that he lived that recoil after my rage steal so that I would bring in my Feraligator and just try to set up a Dragon Dance on him, which I do successfully did that, so... Um, I did get my off by Dragon Dance, so here I'm just get ready to sweep the rest of his team. Well, actually, just his Miss Magius, but that's basically it. So I go for a Waterfall, and that's gonna KO the Miss Magius, which is awesome thanks to the Dragon Dance since I outspeed it and stuff. So yeah, and his last Pokemon is a Moltres, which will die by the uh, Stout Rock. So that was a really good game. Oh my God, noob! Uh, please go check out this guy's uh, channel. The link will be in the description on your right. Don't forget to check out Pie Chunk's uh, channel. She's a definitely awesome narrator, YouTube Wi-Fi battler, and all that crap. So I do recommend you go subscribe to her now. If you just watch one of her videos, you'll be like, "Damn, I just have to subscribe." So yeah. Uh, thank you guys for watching this battle. Uh, comment, rate, and subscribe. And yes, I will check you guys later. Peace out, bitches.